Hi guys! With this video, we're gonna talk about how lenses are used in telescopes. But, what are telescopes? We're gonna start off in having a short scenario. So there is a person that is extremely far away from you. And now, what will happen? Of course, you will not see it from your position. And because of that, the angle that the eyes softened at your ring or the image of him that is formed on your retina is extremely small. Therefore, you can see him very clearly. So, what will you do? You will probably use a telescope or maybe a pair of binoculars. After you use them, you will suddenly see that or feel that he became more closer to you. And how exactly does this work? Before we head into the main discussion, let us first know the definition of lenses, what are the different types of lenses, and what lenses are used in telescopes. A lens is a transparent optical device that can change the direction of the course of light by refraction. In other terms, a lens can enhance an object by making it smaller, bigger, inverted, and etc. There are two types of lenses, convex lens and concave lens. A convex lens is a lens that converges rays of light that travels parallel to its principal axis. They are identified by their shape which is thick across the middle and thin on the upper and lower edges. A concave lens, however, possesses at least one surface that curves inwards. It's a diverging lens, meaning it spreads out light rays that have been refracted through it. And now, as a breakthrough on how telescopes work, Mr. Berindes will tell you on what lenses are used in telescopes. Most refracting telescopes use two main lenses. The largest lens is called the objective lens, and the smaller lens used for viewing is called the eyepiece lens. The objective is the optical element that gathers light from the object being observed and focuses the light rays to produce a real image. Objectives can be a single lens or mirror or combination of several optical elements. An eyepiece is a type of lens that is attached to a variety of optical devices such as the telescopes and microscopes. It is so named because it is usually the lens that is closest to the eye when someone looks through the device. In some time. So what happens is, so the, the objective receives pallid rays because the object is extremely far off. So it's almost at infinity. So these pallid rays are focused by the, uh, by the objective and it forms a real inverted and diminished image. Now the thing is, the eyepiece is placed in such a way that this image is formed at the focus of the eyepiece itself. So therefore, the eyepiece forms a virtual inverted and magnified image of this particular image. Why? Because this image acts as an object for the eyepiece, right? And why is the image inverted? Because this image also is inverted. So as I said, you finally end up having a virtual inverted and magnified image. Now, if you see, you can see that the angle subtended by this image at the eye is greater than the angle that the object subtended at the eye. So therefore, this is why when you see through a telescope, you actually it looks like the object is much closer. And that's how telescopes work. And we're done. Thank you for watching and I hope you guys learned something from this video. Bye bye.